Welcome to video two of the Quick Start series for the Analog Discovery 2. In this video, we'll go through installing Waveforms 2015 on a Mac. If your machine is not a Mac, click on the correct one. Let's get started. In the last video, we downloaded Waveforms 2015. Click on the DMG file. Once you click on the file, it'll create a drive on your desktop. Click on that drive to open it. Once you open the drive, you can drag the Waveforms 2015 logo into the Applications folder. Now Waveforms 2015 is installed. Next, we'll need to install the Digilent FTDI driver to allow Waveforms 2015 to connect to Digilent devices. Double-click to open that. Because of my security settings, I have to go into System Security to allow the Digilent software to make changes. This will open the digital and FTDI driver installer. Click continue. Click continue again. Read the entire license agreement and click agree. Next, you can select the destination for the install and click continue. It'll warn you of the amount of space it's going to take up. Click install. Click close to close the installer. Now you can open the applications folder and double click on the link for Waveforms 2015 to open it. Again, due to my security systems, I have to allow the computer to open it. If no Analog Discovery 2 is plugged in when you open Waveforms 2015, you can still run it in demo mode. This will allow you to see all of the features of Waveforms 2015 without a device. For example, you can run the oscilloscope and it will show you a square and sinusoid wave. Once you plug in the Analog Discovery 2, it will appear in the Device Manager. You can click on it and click Select to connect to it. Once you're connected to your Analog Discovery 2, you can take advantage of all of the features of Waveforms 2015. Thank you for watching this video about installing Waveforms 2015. The next video in the series is about the device manager and calibrating your Analog Discovery 2. To watch that video, click on the link below.